the way the space industry is is established right now with decades of history of NASA driving things, there are some very significant research centers at universities for space exploration. And what we're doing is we're creating a new institute, a new go-to place for the private space industry, one that isn't completely beholden to NASA and the whims of Congress and the funding cycles of the budget, but one that serves the needs of the private space industry. Putting the team together at Penn State was very exciting and worked really well from the beginning. And within about a week of initiating this conversation, they approved the establishment of the team. And so at the very beginning, we went right to the top and have had strong support up and down the administration from the beginning. This mission requires a craft that can land on the moon and then move 500 meters. The craft that can land on the moon must have the capability to take off and land again a second time. And that's what we're doing. So we've got the most straightforward, simplest design that you could come up with to land on the moon and then move 500 meters. Nothing extra, nothing over the top, but definitely the winner of this prize. About a year from now, we will be well into the second stage of our program. We have not only developed a mission concept, but a complete program plan from front to back, all the way to the flight and end of the mission. But what we're really about here is building a long-term capability at the university, an institute that serves the opening field of private space exploration. And so we talk about this in terms of our mission with a small m, the Google Lunar X Prize mission to the surface of the moon, and mission with a big M, um, our, our longer-term mission, which is to build this institute that is a place for the private space industry to come to, to look for all the things that's, that the private space exploration is going to need in the future. And because we're looking many decades down the road in terms of what we want this institute and this capability to be, we are beginning now not by looking for one big donor to just make all of this happen, but we're building a consortium around this program so that when we finish our mission to the moon, when we, when we win the Google Lunar X Prize, we will know already what is next and where to go from here so that we can win the prize and immediately move on to the next big thing that the Penn State Space Institute will pursue.